so after installing solidworks and after spending a lot of your precious time you come to know at a point when you load solidworks it loads it initializes vba engine it has successfully loaded the registry but at the loading task pens screen your pc hangs up and it is not showing up anything and you are stuck at loading task pens so if that is the case with you then this video will be helpful for you and let's go into this video first open up control panel and go to programs and features first see whether you have already installed any solidworks program in your pc and if it is there then please uninstall it and check twice before installing a newer version of solidworks because you have to remove the older version of solidworks entirely in order to not get complicated with the upcoming steps and then go to windows run and type in reg edit it means registry editor and go to these things h h key classes root and below this h key current user a tab is given just click on that and go here to software and in this software see carefully whether you are having solid works stated here or not there will be a folder in the alphabetical order yes uh, here i am having share it technologies and then it comes t tech power up so solid works corporation or solid works related file is not present here if it is in your computer then just click it on type it and delete it just go to your computer and just go to c and users and your username with folders and here you have to enable view hidden items so that you can view the hidden folders and go to app data and go to roaming in this please double check if any thing is related to solid works see here i am having stuff like that solid works if we have previously installed versions and its residues left over then it will not allow you to install a newer version of solid works and it will create problems at the loading screen so just right click it and delete this folder and just go back again give it a refresh and just come back again and see whether it is available or not so we have deleted this file go to program files x86 and program files so your ordinary program files means uh, your installed windows 64 bit program files are here and program files x86 is uh, uh, if you have installed any files uh, which support 32 bit it will be listed down here so double check in both the folders for solidworks presence so here i am not having anything listed out like solidworks and i am going to program file 686 make sure to double check that solidworks not even a single file should be present there and just go to windows run and hit percentage tmp percentage then here you can see solidworks folders there control a shift delete and delete them yep 
again you should go and see in this PC local disk C users edits and app data roaming yep so no solution here you can see a dust system a folder is there just delete it we don't want anything related to SOLIDWORKS go to programs and in the programs just here's one option turn window switches on or off click that you can see here a dot is given in dotnet framework 4.7 advanced services but it is unchecked in dotnet framework 3.5 which includes dotnet 2.0 and 3.0 your software might become un unstable if you have unchecked this box it will be unchecked uh, during the start you have to do this manually by your own hands just click it which will enable these things you have to check this box both the boxes then just click ok then the windows will show a prompt like this searching for the required files and your windows needs files from the windows update to finish installing some features ok let windows could do the problem just I'm, I have not enabled my internet connection I'm going to enable my internet connection and this time I'm going to see right now yep now the net connection is activated go to Windows program files just click on it ok searching for little windows update download the files for you windows needs files from windows update to finish installing some features yep so windows had done the required changes now after doing that you have to double check because you have to check everything now the dot is there and you are, you are clicking ok now go ahead check it right you have both the boxes enabled just click ok then without having anything left Without having anything left you have to restart your PC once again and then you have to do the following steps before doing so if you have any antivirus software just turn it off go to the settings again and turn it off <laughs> I'm going to do the solid box 2018 opened up
we still here? Just to suffer? Every night, I can feel my leg and my arm, even my fingers. The body I've lost. The comrades I've lost won't stop hurting. It's like they're all still there. You feel it too, don't you? I'm just going to show you guys that uh, SolidWorks 2018 works perfectly. And see here, it's verifying the license and it's loading user interface components, visualizing VBA engine. And yeah, it's starting the SolidWorks Poster Cam, and it will start out. And you can see very well here clearly that I have drawn certain things with this, so that I can be clear that this one is no longer stuck in at anywhere. So see here, I've drawn these things, and uh, like for example, let's open this uh, tire part that I have drawn previously after installing and now we can clearly say that if solid if you have solidworks and if your solidworks is stuck during the screen of loading task panes or initializing VBA engine or loading host then you may have to delete the registry and try it once again reinstalling it or you can just reset your PC entirely deleting the Windows C drive and then you can reinstall windows and then you can reinstall solidworks again for me it works and when i searched in youtube there is only one video stating the fix for solidworks error and that video says that you have to close the application and restart the application once again and it will be solved instead of showing that fix to all people you can show your middle finger right and yeah, that's what uh, I want to say and from here you have clearly seen that my SOLIDWORKS is working and you can do you can too try this fix in your PC and just let me know if you have any doubt in the comment section below if you like this video just give a thumbs up subscribe to my youtube channel and hit the bell icon to get notified whenever I upload a new video thanks for watching see you soon until then bye from JK